I feel like I'm gonna burp. Don't vomit. Wait a minute. Trigger warning, there could be vomiting in this video from all this food we eat. Uh, uh, Sexy. <laughs> What's up you guys, my name is Ryan Thomas Woods and today I'm here with my good American friend, Michael. And today we're gonna be doing what, Michael? We're gonna be trying uh, food. Canadian versus American food because one of my very first videos was American versus British food, and yeah. that that shit went crazy, and it's almost at like a million views. So today we're gonna be eating Canadian food I brought from Canada, and you got some American food from America. Yes. Yay, English! I think the first food we should start with would be coffee, because I'm a little tired. I'm a little dead. It's <laughs> like too early in the morning or too late at night. I don't know what time it is, but I need coffee. So you got something from... Dunkin' Donuts. Which is very American. America runs on Dunkin'. And I got something from Tim Hortons, which is very Canadian. That sounds like Horton Here's a Who. Hor Tim, what is that? Yeah. That's that Dr. Seuss. He didn't make this coffee. Okay. So this is a double-double. Do you know what a double double is? No, but it sounds sexual. It's just coffee with two cream and two sugar. Oh, okay. Double -double. So when you go and order, instead of saying like two cream, two sugar, you say, I want a double double. So there's your double double, and what is this? It's a Dunkin' Donuts iced coffee. Okay, so this is a very American thing. Yes, it is. Okay, so I just take our sip and I tell you Yeah, you just pull is. it back. Okay. And you just, you have a sip. Three, two, one. I like it. All right. I place it in between Dunkin' Donuts and Starbucks. So it's better than, you think it's better than I Dunkin'? I think it's better than Dunkin' Donuts, but I wouldn't pay for it as much as I would pay for a Starbucks. Starbucks, right. I prefer Starbucks. So Starbucks for both of us is at like a higher level. Yeah. And then Tim Hortons. And then, I don't know, this just kind of reminds me a little bit of like Tim Hortons. I like this. Between a meh and a wow, I give it a okay. 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 <laughs> <laughs> now, what's special about this cup is that it is roll up the rim. You're chugging, okay. So I'm gonna explain to the people at home what roll up the rim is. Once a year or twice a year, Tim Hortons has these cups where you roll up the rim to win. You gotta do it where the arrow is. All right. It's a skill. Canadians put it on their resume when we know how to roll up a rim. I bet you do. Did you win? Uh. Jesus. <laughs> oh, read it. Please play again. Please? That's, that's, you know. That you happens. Tim Hortons? That happens, you Can lose. Can I curse on your channel? I'll probably bleep it. Really? Yeah. Shit. Sucker. Mother. Okay. <laughs> That's enough out of you. So Michael didn't win at rolling up the rim, but you won at rimming. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Let's do cookies. Cookies! So I brought from Canada some maple leaf cookies, which is traditional Canadian, like, staple. Okay, pie. good, because yeah. I brought apple pie cookies because there's nothing more American than apple pie. Give me that. You eat these. But it's Canadian. Yeah. They're really sweet, though. Oh, these are cute. They have like little like cupcake wrapper holder things. Like very fancy. Oh my God, this smells so good. Oh my God, that smells like an apple tart. I know. This smells like- Maple. Egg. Smells like syrup. Three, okay. two, cheers. Mm. Oh, that's softer than I expected. This is not softer than I expected. This is like, it's really sweet. It's sweet, isn't it? It tastes like a hard pancake. Like, that's been, it's, okay, it's like a pancake. A hard, what kind of pancakes do you eat here? It's like a pancake that saturated up all the syrup and then got stale. That's what this is. Canada better step its shit up. Out of 10? Four. Okay. I give this a, like a seven out of 10. So now that we've tried something sweet, we're gonna try something salty. So these are Lay's ketchup chips. Why? Have you had these before? No. Very Canadian. I don't know why we love ketchup chips. It's Lay's, which is an American company, but it's flavor, it's ketchup. It's yeah. It's ketchup flavor. Well, I, Lay's is an American company, that's why I went with Lay's, but I said that this, it was Okay, not... I've never seen this. Oh, cheesy garlic bread flavor. America likes to be creative. Three, two, one. Oh, I'm pregnant. I almost just went in and ate my own chips. Wait a minute. How guilty. Wait a minute. What? It smells like. It smells like what? It smells like farts. Ew! It's like good, but then not. Nah. It's right. like. Oh, that smells like a cheesy fart. Right? All right. Okay. Wait, these don't look good. What are you talking about? They're like they're like ketchup flavor. They're supposed to be like red. Ryan, these they're look. They're red. I swear to God. Ryan, these look diseased. This looks like a fart. Look at this! That looks like a bloody fart. You, can this <laughs> you need to get that checked, girl. Okay, cheers. Don't touch my nail. Yeah. Mm -mm. Nope. No. -uh. Did you just spread that out? What are you talking about? These are great. Ketchup chips are so good. Oh my god. <laughs> don't vomit. That really is disgusting. I love that. Like I, I don't. <coughs> It's like a, it's like a salty vinegar ketchup. No, I hate when people pretend to hate shit, but that is 
fucking gross. You really actually hate this. I actually fucking really? hate that. That surprises me. So out of 10, what would you give these? Two. Really? It's so overpowering. This one feels like just a hint of something. It doesn't taste like anything. Because it's American, so it's automatically better than Canada. Obviously. Not. And of all the chips I've ever tried, I'd honestly give those like a three out of 10. Because I don't feel like they're worth my, I don't know. I mean, they're not great, but they're, they're something I would throw in a bowl for a barbecue. So I would I'd rather have barbecue chips for a barbecue. Okay. Okay, well, okay. okay. So I'm giving you a coffee crisp. I'm in. This is like one of my favorite chocolate bars because it tastes like coffee, it has chocolate, it's everything you need. I say I'm gonna give you uh, Three Musketeers. Three Musketeers is basically just like chocolate with like- Is that like three men in a bar? You would know about that. <laughs> it's basically like a mousse filling. With chocolate like, on the other side. Like my kind of Canadian mousse? Like a Canadian mousse! It's, you chocolatized a mousse? I did. I'm actually excited for this one. Cheers. I heard your crutch. <laughs> it does taste like a fluffy thing, like a fluffy mousse in a chocolate thing. I don't know what I'm saying. This is an oversized wafer. It tastes nothing like coffee. No, yes, it does. It does not. I taste nothing but wafer and chocolate. So it's like a chocolate wafer. Yeah, I mean, it's not bad, but it's not coffee. I just feel like this is chocolate on chocolate. This tastes like coffee. I love this. Yeah. Would you rather have this or this? I'd rather have this. While we are on the topic of chocolate, I brought Joe Joss Luzi. I don't know how to pronounce this. Joe, Lu I always said uh -huh. Joe Louis. I think uh -huh. that's how you spell it. Say it. What? I don't know. It's like a flying saucer. I don't know what that is. It's kind of like a moon pie. Yeah. Well, these are kind of like half moon things as well. It's just is like it? cream in the middle. Like, yeah, we call them Joe Louis. Oh my god. Ho hos, can we just take a minute? That's why it's mine. Design. That's why you got it for me. Leave a comment if you're Canadian and you know how to pronounce this because I, it, look, how, how do you, how would you say that? Joe's Lewis. That's what I thought too. What is but it? But we say Joe Louis. Joe? Louis. Like you don't, like the That's S That's not how you silent. spell Joe. I know, I don't know. Canada, Maybe I'm wrong. Man. I'm, I'm so excited for my hoo hoos. Hoo hoos! Ryan, I'm gonna yeah. tell you something that you're used to hearing. Just what? shut up and put it in your mouth. This is actually hard. I was expecting something softer. Why is this hard? I bet he was. <laughs> look at this. Look at this. Ooh. It doesn't look as, like, what is it? This looks deformed. That looks like something that came out of my ass. Like Literally. Great. I'm gonna eat it now. Cheers. I like it. I like it there. Don't, no! I'm gonna eat it. Give me some of it. Joe Louie? Ew. I want some of my Josh Louie. Chat Louis. Oh, this tastes so much better than this, though. Here, you have some of this, Wow. You ate? What kind of bite is this? Mm. You didn't even get the cream. Which one's better, this one or this one? I like that one. I like that one. But this is too soft. See, that's why I like it. I like it soft. Maybe that's an American-Canadian thing. We like it soft and you guys like it hard. Well, thank you guys for watching part one. If you would like to see part two of this video, please click over there and you will see us devour more food or click over to my channel where I turn Ryan into a Jersey socialite, which will be really interesting. I better get a big poof. Give it a big thumbs up because that really helps a bitch out. So, help a bitch out. Help a bitch out.